Tony Tabor here in Sevierville in we're at Lowe's. And we heard that the Christmas stuff is out. We're going to take a look at that. We also have to run in and get some other things as well. And then I think we're going to head over to Home Depot because we know the Christmas stuff is out over there. Yeah. Dawn, are you ready? I am ready. Let's do, Let's it. do this. Christmas and Halloween is right across the way. They're starting to clear it out. <laughs> he is. <laughs> He's five hundred dollars or four hundred ninety-eight. Look, they got all the Christmas trees out. Oh my goodness, these guys are so cute. Here's a little LED gnome. $129 for the, like the tree. Yeah, the, tree, uh, the tree's really cool. 80 inch. Oh yeah. Isn't the turtle cute? He's getting fish a canopy. Yeah, he's probably one of the cutest, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> and then he the frog and a pig is fun too. Yeah, the pig is like soft. It is. What? A Christmas peacock. A Christmas peacock? $89. You can use this today to take home. That, he's colorful. Yeah. Very, very colorful. It's a nice reef for like the side of your house or made by the front porch. Oh, like the, the cow is cute. <laughs> yeah. Fifty dollars. So Lowe's has got it. They got a lot of cool stuff. And it's fun just to take it all in. And this little guy sitting on his egg glue. He's cute. <laughs> he is. Now that's Santa for three hundred dollars. Two hundred and eighty. Oh. Very cool. Oh, Christmas is going to be here before we know it. And we got some feed for Dawn's little feathery friends and furry friends here. Some corn. I got some some true fuel for the for the weed whacker or the weed whip. Weed eater, I guess, depending on where you're coming from and how you And Don's got, oh, you know, so you can clean the washing machine. Yeah, tide, pot, tide washing machine cleaner with Oxy. Oh, Oxy. Yeah, we do that like once every so many months. Yeah. yeah. But Christmas is here at Lowe's. And there's a whole section behind you we got to go take a look at. Oh, my goodness, Don. You have Snoopy up there in Woodstock. And they're driving along. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of fun. Santa Claus. Merry Christmas. You have all the extension cords you need. Power stake. You're getting pretty serious if you're buying a power stake. Just saying. Oh, yeah. Welcome mat. We'll be bringing our Christmas welcome mat out pretty soon. But, yeah, they have all the lights now these here, if you had bushes, we don't have any bushes, um, but uh, you can put those over, and icicles. I remember when icicles first came out, it was like a, just amazing. Now everybody pretty much has icicle. icicle, so icicles, yes, definitely. And I do like this, like, it's not neon, it's kind of LED, but uh, yeah, that's a lot of fun too. It is. These ones here, you have a remote and you can change the colors of the lights on your house. Here's some for the the pathway as well. And all kinds of inflatables. There's Santa. I've seen that one before. And this one here is real cute too. It's Santa sitting in a hammock. Yeah. This Christmas tree looks like a lot of fun. 
does. Oh yeah, you gotta have the Grinch. Now I saw somewhere they had a creepy like 20 foot tall Grinch. Oh, that was at Home Depot across the street, wasn't it? Yeah. We'll have to go over there and take a look at that as well. But these guys are all a lot of fun. He is, he is. And look at, you got the Nutcracker, you got Frosty, it's all that bendable. Um, yeah. Ho, ho, ho. Makes you want to go home and decorate, right? <laughs> but it's still October. Yeah, we haven't even done a Halloween yet. And the, ho and the Christmas stuff is out here. The Halloween stuff is out as well. You got all the garland over here. That is kind of cool. It says joy. You can put those like maybe on the edge of your porch or something. Kind of reminds me of the Charlie Charlie Brown tree a little bit. But uh, wow. Yeah, and this tree here would be a great one, even for like the studio or a small room. It's different. It's not traditional, but it could still be fun. And you could do a lot to decorate. Your house for the holidays. They even have Santa's. Oh, and they have blow molded figurines and nativity up there. It even gets its own bird. <laughs> oh yeah, the birds are chirping. Yeah, well, Mickey Mouse coming out of the chimney. There's Donald. So they do have Disney if you want to decorate for your house in Disney. Oh. And they have all kinds of fun uh, Disney. Like, oh, it reminds me of the Mickey Mouse phone, doesn't it? It is a Mickey Mouse phone. Holiday phone. Try me, it says. And they have Scooby-Doo and oh, wow. <laughs> Snoopy. Scooby-Doo and Snoopy together. Yeah, those two got together, oh boy. There'd be some trouble. They have the Grinch. Mr. Grinch. Uh oh, what's this one? A oh, little blow molded. Oh. And then you got this here. The radio. Oh, it's got the Grinch. Very cool. Frosty. <laughs> it pops out of the chimney. I think it's a chimney. <laughs> it is. It is. Wow, they got a lot of cool, cool things in here. Yeah, they have a whole section here. And then there's the Grinch tree up there. $99. Oh my goodness. I almost want to buy that right now. But we already bought an, a tree for the studio last year. Uh, that says it's uh, five foot tall. Yeah, it's five foot tall drink, Grinch tree. 50 bucks. I hope he's got oil in the back. I think he does. Oil. Oil. Let's call it oil. See? Oh, okay. Cool. <laughs> I think it's a great idea to invest in these little gutter hooks if you're going to put lights up. Um, I think um, it, they'll, it'll pay for itself over time. Easier to take things off and... But... Yeah. And boy, do they have a lot of trees. Oh my goodness, they have a whole Santa village. I don't ever recall them having a whole Santa village in the past, but look at this. <laughs> oh wow, I love the uh, that ring of fire back there. It's, it's yeah, it's called Merry Christmas. There's Santa, and there's the little um, paratrooper back in there. Oh, wow. Oh, Dawn, see that up there? It's a it's a aerial tramway, kind of like Gatlinburg. Oh, they do have them. Yeah. It's an aerial tramway.
And we've got a lighthouse over here, all decked up for the holidays. Post office. And the price of these, well, some of the smaller ones are 20 and then some of the buildings are 60 They have the um, parachute drop for $90. The lighthouse is 90 That's cool, the lighthouse. The Frosty is 80 So these are not priced that bad um, compared to other places I see these in. And then there's the, they call it the, Hol the Holiday Train Express, but we know it as... The Ring of Fire. And what do they want for that? Uh, $80 as well. $119 for the, um, the Santa Village workshop. Everything to deck the halls, as they would say. I think I'm almost in the spirit now. <laughs> It does, it really does. And where do you put a Christmas tree this tall? You gotta have a, a ceiling in your house. I think a 12 foot tall. You gotta have 12 foot ceilings in your house. Yeah, I don't think that's I mean, you gotta be at least, what, 15 foot ceiling, or you're gonna be, how you put the star on that, right? And this one here is flocked. I love that kind of snowy look as well. Not badly priced though, like 700 for that 12 foot tree. But uh, these nine footers are, are 550. Uh, now this one here looks real. And that's 500. So, they do have a lot of, a lot of nice trees. And the one thing I will say is that Lowe's has a huge, I mean a huge selection of Christmas lights and, and decor all together. Uh, they're really going over the top and they, they also had a really great Halloween display as well. So and I think they kind of want to be known as a place to come to get what you need. Yeah, uh, and look up there. I mean, all those inflatables up there. I'll have to step back a couple aisles to take it all in. And there's all those inflatables. They got a little inflatable cow, cow up there. And Snoopy. <laughs> that Christmas tree. He's a he's a jamming. I do like that that big frosty head. I think it's huge. Yeah. I mean, it's it's quite big. And there's a kangaroo. Kind of reminds me of like Winnie the Pooh, right? Yeah. I don't think it's a uh, licensed Winnie the Pooh, but it, it looks a lot like it. And there's <laughs> old Santa snoozing. Can't go, can't go wrong with that. I don't remember seeing these guys here the last time we were. But yeah, the Halloween stuff is thinned out. They still have a couple members of this rock band here. <laughs> but they're pretty much cleared out. They don't have they don't have much at all. Of course, Christmas is pushing this out. And some of the stuff's on clearance as well. Ah, they're skeletons. <laughs> pretty crazy seeing Halloween and right next to the Christmas, but I do like the bomble. If I had 500 extra dollars, I think I'd buy him. I, I don't know what to do with him, because he, because he's, he's, he's like, than the garage. he's like 12 foot tall. I mean, literally. Yeah, he's like 12 foot tall. Okay, let's go ahead and check out. And across the street from Lowe's is Home Depot. And Christmas is in full swing here at the Home Depot. Cute little penguins. Oh uh, yeah, and Dawn, it's Bob. It's Bob. <laughs> He's $200. Well, anyways, Bob doesn't work, but I'm assuming he he must sway back and forth and his his mouth must go up and down, right? Oh, the nutcracker. His eyes open and that. And he's $250. It's like a Christmas wonderland here in October. 
We haven't even done Halloween yet. <laughs> $179 is great big archway. And they have a huge selection of LED lights. And up there they got some lawn decor. And those reindeer are are super, super cool. I like them. You got the Grinch over there. And Don's got a Frosty just like that at home. Uh, he blows up though. He's more of an um, uh, inflatable. And here's one of Santa's reindeer. And he is huge as well. He's eight and a half foot tall. They want $300. And Santa himself for $300. Giant size Santa, as they say. He's LED, so he must light up or something. Uh, I bet you his eyes light up. His eyes look like, but there's, yeah, and the lantern probably does. But there's no way of activating him. But he's also $300. And I'll tell you what, you have that Santa in your front yard, people are going <laughs> to, you know what I mean? They're going to look. They're going to look, because he's, he's huge. He's, I think he's almost Adam tall. <laughs> but, yeah, yeah. And then they got some little Christmas bulbs down here, yeah, as well. They're $150 for them. Very cool. Yeah, so these guys are are fun too, and they got little Christmas lights. A penguin. Christmas trees are a little bit cheaper here, I think, than they were over at Lowe's. At least that's they're not as priced as high. Yeah, they got the great big eight foot tall Santas in the box, ready to go. You gotta put them together. Come back about a week and a half, two weeks from now, and you probably won't find them anymore. They'll probably be gone. Because um, there's a lot of businesses in the area. They're getting ready to take down their fall decor, and they'll be looking for this. And they'll, they won't come in and just buy one. They'll come in and buy all four of them. Especially they have like four different businesses or something. <laughs> oh, he actually, look at that. Oh, his mouth Yeah. Oh, wow. Here's Mickey. Wish you were married. Oh, that's Aww. cute. <laughs> that is cute. <laughs> yeah. You can light up the pathway with these guys. They're LED. They got a Grinch set here as well. I don't know if there's a way of turning those guys on, but they want $40. This is battery-operated garland. Yeah, so here's a, uh, a Grinch. Uh, it's lighted tinsel. They want $79. Makes me want to go home and start pulling the Christmas stuff out. I think the neighbors would think we were crazy decorating for Christmas. But Pigeon Forge, Sevierville, and Gatlinburg are already putting out their Christmas yep. lights. They haven't lit them yet, but they are all out. Everything is out. All they got to do is flip the switch. And that will be happening pretty soon here in November. November the 7th, I think, is when they're, they're going to flip the lights on. Sometimes the lights will come on a, f a day or so before in certain areas as they test them. But... Um, Oh, you know another thing I'm excited for? Riverwalk. Yeah. Yes, yes, Winterfest Wonders of Light. I wonder if they did anything new this year. I hope so. That'd be kind of fun. That's Grinch. And I think Frosty's a little cold. Whoever thought of Frosty being kind of chilly. So we found the box for Bob. And he sings four different songs, right? Festive songs. His eyes light up. His um, eyes, mouth, and waist move. So he kind of dances. Here's some of their inflatables. And I saw that up there, the, um, the milkshake, where they're they kind of like, I don't know, they're kind of like they're cold or something. And uh, yeah, little blow-molded blow friends. Oh my goodness, look at this. <laughs> 
That's cute. You know, a good quality too, but I'm I'm curious on what Mindy does. That is really cool, and they're good quality. I like the, you know, like their heads are really good quality plastic, you know? That is that is cool. Mickey was cool. And then here is Little Grinch, four foot tall. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's copyright, but he's $149. Oh, Stuart. So for six hundred dollars, you can get all three of them. Oh, here's here's the Grinch. I wonder what he does. I'm gonna put him on the ground here, right? This Santa's pretty cool. He's thirty dollars. Here's a Santa dog. Oh, oh he's, he's cute. He is. <laughs> uh, sings like me, actually. And then, of course, you gotta see what Santa's doing over here. Oh boy. That's copyright. Yeah. I like how he dances, though. Isn't that yeah. cool? Yeah. Okay, Snoop. That's cool. He's a rocking out cow, cow, and bull. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> so Christmas is coming quicker than we could ever have imagined. And November the 7th, all the lights here in the Great Smoky Mountains are going to turn on. Everything's going to start twinkling. Um, and Home Depot and Lowe's are already out with the Christmas cheer. I think it keeps getting earlier and earlier each year. Now, which, out of all the things that we've seen, what, what's, I guess, in other words, out of everything that we've seen, what store you think was like the best selection, the best? I think Lowe's had a better selection. Yeah, I think so. Now, some things they were priced more than they were yeah. at Home Depot. So, I mean, either store, but um, I did like the great big, huge, like 10 foot tall, 12 foot tall bomb. Those are cool. <laughs> I don't know where you would put them. <laughs> I don't know where you would put them either, but he'd be, he'd be, he'd be fun. And then they had the great big Santa Claus over here at Home Depot. And he was a lot of fun as well. And they had a lot of like little uh, toys that would, you know, do things for you. Like, you know, it's kind of fun too. And um, so, yes, Dawn got some bird feed for yeah. the feeders because we were running low on Our that. furry little friends be happy. Yeah, the furry <laughs> friends and the feathery friends. Yeah, feathery friends. And folks, that's going to do it for today here in Sevierville. I know it was a little vlog. Uh, we had a little bit of time between family to go out and shoot a few things. Also... We were at Home Depot uh, because we had to get some other things and Lowe's other than Christmas. But we figured we'd show it to you while we were there. And uh, if you guys like this vlog, give it a thumbs up. 
We love you, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, Bye everyone. everyone.